perfect day. Here in the state of Michigan, it's the University of Massachusetts Minutemen on the road to take on the Eastern Michigan. Type of people he's brought in and recruiting and with the coaching staff. Well, smartly, UMass, after winning the coin toss and deferring to the second. Gray uniform, green lettering, white trim for Eastern Michigan, throwing on second down. This one is caught across the 30-yard line and then leveled across. So second down at 11. Davis over the middle, put some air underneath it, had some contact, trying to find his favorite target. Defense pre-snap. There goes Gino Campiotti, the tight end, and he is a blocker on the screen pass that goes to Simpson, who drags a defender. Defense like the Red Sea. Play action, pass caught, and that is a first down to the 45 of the flat. Eyes downfield, Austin Smith trying to find somebody open. Flag comes in in the backfield. He's got it to Canoe across the 30, tiptoeing down the sideline, and he's going to walk into the end zone. There are 25 Massachusetts natives on this UMass roster. Again, from his own end zone, pass a little high. This one hauled in, and it's got first to St. Rita High School in Chicago. That play was doomed from the start. Lynch Adams was being tackled. Davis, after looking right, sets up the screen the other way, and a big play. Greg DeWozier, which changes hands every week. Flag flies on third down. Davis tackled near the first down marker. Left in the fourth quarter. Return to practice this past week. They say he's back to normal. Floats it up and gets intercepted. Big, but he's got speed to burn, and he can get open, as he was on that last play. Swing it out right side. Inside the 40-yard line. They go that way. Evans patiently kicks it outside. He's got a first down and much more. He's been dealing with a groin injury this year. From just inside 40 yards, it's good. Recovery. Quarterback hurries. He's all over the place. Jez Jean Vier also in on that play. Quick strike for UMass. Big pickup on second down, and that'll be a nutshell man behind the quarterback. Davis. Throwing right side. Got a wide open man who adjusts to the football. George Johnson, the third, with another big play for the minute. Which is one of the many symbols used by Coach Creighton around here. Taking a shot deep. Caught inside the five yard line. Passing offense, neither running offense has really been able to sustain well. much. Need to find out if UMass is going to protect the football. Right now, they're being outplayed by this. Pass is caught. It's a first down for Eastern Michigan to the 19-yard. On the sweep, turning the corner. Von Swinton, a former Indiana, why they wear the outfits on game day that they do. They are very proud of the work ethic of the folks in this part of the country. Protection eventually, but if they can get him in space, look out. Here he goes. Has a hole, a big hole. Makes a cut inside the 40-yard line, and they're not. Touchdown, Jalen Jackson. Jackson. In and out, slashing. Tell you what, they better find a get away, get a hand on that guy. It'll be a little. Second and five. Davis has a man caught. Campiotti, who actually started at quarterback a year ago for UMass, but uh, Don Brown wanted to come home to New England on play action. Canoe flag after the play in the offensive backfield. Don Brown gives it away. He has he has coached Marcus. His defense gives up a huge play out across the 40-yard line. What a pickup on plan and just the type of style of play that he wants to coach. Samson Evans with a huge run. Can they catch him? It's knocked out. The football comes loose. The result of the play is a touchback. Back in the 1980s. K-Ron Lynch Adams with his best run of the afternoon. They uh, measured him at 22 miles an hour on the GPS this summer. There's some tough yardage to get the first down and move the chains. He, he can have a job as long as he wants. 
Another third and one. Another big pickup for Lynch Adams. The right side of the line. They're going to run the football that way. Then cut back by Lynch Adams. Good move by him. He is really starting to pile up the yardage with another first down run. Down and one. Austin Smith hands it off. Did the ball come loose? It looks like it came out. UMass says. Pitch and catch over the middle for a big play for UMass. Completed to Gino Campiotti. Got the best hands among enough contribution. A lot of times land scholarships. Lynch Adams across the 50 and finally dragged down from behind at the 45 yard. Wall, he just cut it back. Clock keeps running with a minute 10 to go in the half. Davis just gets rid of it and the flag comes in. Back for that Eagles front four. Davis flushed, throws across his body and throws a strike. Good accuracy again to transfer. The hold is good. And the kick is good. Peter, player is with coach at the University of Massachusetts. Austin Smith dumps it off. Canoe with a couple of quick steps to add some yardage on the back end of that. <laughs> Austin Smith completes the pass over the middle. They get back to the original line of scrimmage. What are you really saying? <laughs> but yes, I, I really think. They're going to be wide open, but quarterback play is going to have to be very at a high premium if they're, if they're going to games you can win on the road. Carlos Davis rolling right, throwing on the run. He's got a man caught and out of bounds. Goes Sean Harris Jr. Mark Pope, the motion man, takes the handoff, coming back the other way. Tries to turn the corner and does. Tiptoes out of bounds with another first down. That's an Davis looking that way, throwing that way. He has a man. Touchdown, UMass. Gino Campiotti for UMass against Eastern. Catches a touchdown pass. To Campiotti. Bulls 10. 519 remaining in the third quarter. Of course, Coastal Carolina has Teal here. They've got the gray. His pass could have been intercepted. Isaiah Rutherford had a shot at it. It's going to dump it off to the under. Away from setting a new personal single game high in rushing yardage. That's going to lose yardage on the reception to Ross. Davis runs, has a man, but just shy of the first down after a couple. Eastern Michigan football from the 26 yard line. Smith going to try to run for it. Into UMass territory inside the 35-yard line. There. He's got the distance, and it is good to put Eastern Michigan back in front. It's 2-1, to one, Eastern over UMass, but a lot of that has been on huge plays. Kyle pushes forward for a first down. Today, he came into the game with 10 and nearly 200 yards. Looking his way. He's got him. From the 40, Simpson inside the 20. Daquan says, if my mom likes you, then you're in the door. That's what happened. Pass intercepted. Way. Bennett Walker one more time. And, and the ball wasn't even intended for Walker's man. Overshot pass, bad space. Campiotti, who has the touchdown, was the motion man, Carlos Davis. Oh. Plenty of time to throw. Pass caught at the 33. Ohio was slow to start the week in practice, but seems to be full strength here today. Keep it on the ground. Lynch Adams adding to his career high performance. Davis down the middle. It is caught. Oh. Trying to take the lead. Going to run for it with Lynch Adams. Trying to get to the pylon. He's there. Run. That strike there was huge. And it was there earlier. And they ran it back and got the matchup. They wanted a linebacker and a running back on a seam route. Wow. Number 88, Blake Daniels, the big tight end. Smith. Fires. Caught. Into you. Smith flushed rolling right with
time to throw down the field. It's caught at the five. Touchdown, El Saya. In the blink of an eye, puts the Eagles back in front. Off of his back foot, too. You have to be able to tackle in space, stay with your man on the scramble drill. Carlos Davis going to be sacked. Didn't feel the pressure in time. Down, but like you say, it's four down territory. Davis going for it all down the middle, and it is intercepted. Fender came down cleanly with it, but indeed he did a 35-yard line. Here's Davis. Pocket collapses, still keeps it alive, dumps it off to his running back, Lynch Adams, but he's not going to get there. To counter punch and fight back. And that's what that wrench represents to in this program. Of Eastern Michigan and the Southeast Michigan community. Two, the ability to close the gap. And three, the conscious choice to UMass was going to sneak out of here with a narrow victory. Thanks for watching and so long from Ypsilanti, Michigan.